บุญครับสวัสดีครับ The Beautiful Land of Smiles I'm staying here at the Berkeley Hotel right in the heart of Pratunam and if you don't know where Pratunam is it's in the major shopping district of Bangkok okay lots of shopping malls lots of good bargains lots of food lots of things to see it's fantastic by car usually it's about 20 minutes 30 minutes or so from Don Muang Airport to Pratunam area so you have a couple of choices the way I did it was I used my Grab app just open up the Grab app and it will detect that you are in Thailand and you can see the prices over there. I paid about 250 baht. What you should have with you is small change in the Thai baht currency. You pay them to use the highway or expressway so you can get to Pratunam area faster. This is one thing that you should always be prepared for is to bargain, bargain, bargain and if possible, tell your taxi driver to on his meter. I'm so excited to be here. Stick around because uh, I'm going to be showing you a walkabout tour inside the hotel and also outside as well. Again, if you found this video helpful and enjoyable, please remember click like and subscribe to our channel. Let's go! Muay Thai! Bah, bah. Free shuttle bus service, but judging by the amount of people, you have to book early. It's not a bus; it's a van. So a shuttle van service, uh, it's free. But you may, yeah. And these are the drop-off points you can go to at a time. Available BTS Chitlom, sini. BTS Chitlom is here. Siam Paragon and Central World is the last one. This one here. So very convenient, lah. Tapi kena book awal lah, eh? okay, you have to book early in order to enjoy this. It starts with two because this is the north tower. Eh? So it's two, three, four, one, zero. Quite long, right? The other tower, the main tower starts with a one. So this is it. This is my room. The hotel was uh, sort of like kind enough to give me a small upgrade. But I wish it was for the bathtub, but it's not. They gave me an extra bed instead. <laughs> and as usual, you got all of the mini bar. Items over here, Coffee Mate, Nescafe, and bottled water, Chang bottled water, excellent, of course, we are in Thailand. Now check this out guys, this, is, this was quite a shocker for me. Five star hotel without a mini fridge, look at that. The cupboards look like this, quite spacious. Bathrobes, this room is for three, as you can see, three sets of everything. Hangers over here, there's a room safe, hair dryer. And of course, you got a couple of laundry bags as well. Full-length mirror, single bed, double bed. This is uh, perfect for three people, yeah? If you have a really small family, like uh, daddy, mommy and a child, this is perfect for you guys. Okay, this is where you put your luggage, your shoes, a uh, little bit of cabinetry over here, small TV. There's a mirror over here, and the power supply is as such. The only kind of international adapters you will get is uh, built into the working desk. Everywhere else around are the Thailand style plugs. And no, they do not provide international adapters for you to use in your room. In-room dining is available and it's uh, available 24 hours a day. You gotta scan the QR code over here. Interestingly enough, the master switches do not do anything. If you, if you off the switches from over there, uh, it does not switch off everything at one go. So you have to individually 
of this, of this, manually. There's no master switch anywhere, okay? And it took me quite a while, but I finally found the switch for some of the lights. <laughs> and it's hidden behind this bed over here, like that. Oh, goodness me. So, yeah, bad than mine. But the price is not very cheap. It goes according to the uh, occupancy. If there's a lot of people in the hotel, that means it's going to get higher. If it's quiet, then you get a cheaper rate. So this is my view. 34th floor. I wish I knew what building was this. This is an interesting design. I think there's a park, a little park over there. And that's the sky bridge. That's the sky bridge to Central World. Let me show you the bathroom real quick. Toilet is quite spacious. It's quite nice. Got your cups there. All of your towels. Towels are nice and fluffy. Like so. Um, when you request for a shaver, they do provide you shavers, but they don't have shaving foam. And these are the amenities, like so. Their own brand, which smells a little bit citrusy. It's really, really dark. Gelap. Do you see that? No light at all for the shower stall. Oh dear. Once you on the shower, and uh, you know, you put some soap, it's gonna be very, very slippery. Rain shower head like this, and also handheld one, which is very, very good. I am not a big fan of this because it's so confusing to use. You either go here for hot, go here for hot. I, I don't like all this kind of guessing game mechanisms. The water pressure is really, really strong. Sangat kuat, yeah? Tekanan air dia. And there's a bidet there, plush is there. That's when you order your pizza, when you do your uh uh. And yeah, that's it. That's the room, guys. Quick room tour here at the Berkeley Hotel, Pratunam, Bangkok. This hotel features two pools and now we are on the 11th floor. This is the North Tower swimming pool. Opens at 7 a.m. Closes at 7 p.m. Here are the two towers. This is the main one. And that's the North Tower, right there. Can you see the domes? Now you can always recognize the hotel by the dome-shaped golden tops that they have. So when you exit the hotel, you walk this way. Can you see right across over there? That's Platinum Mall. And can you see that skywalk thingy? It's all covered. Uh, kalau anda jalan kaki, if you walk this way, you can get to Central World and I think other huge shopping malls over that side as well. So, pretty good location. I hope this helps. I spoke to the uh, concierge earlier and they say that some good popular chicken rice opposite over there. Yeah, that one. That's the popular chicken rice. But the way to get there is to walk this side. Okay, you have to walk straight and then under the, the flyover. 7-Eleven, the Kaja is right, right next to us. Thanks to the hotel, can you see? So let's go check out what's available in 7-Eleven. In case you didn't know, 7-Eleven in Thailand is a whole different level, guys. 7-Eleven in Thailand is oh, always good. So here are your food options. For those of you on the go, you just want to grab a quick bite. We got toasties over here. Uh, we got croissants. Look at that. Ham and cheese. Triple cheese croissant. Pandan. Ham and cheese. Oh, cheese toasted sandwich. Uh, 37 baht. These are the cheaper ones. Shredded pork with salad cream sandwich. <laughs> wow, cool. This is 27 baht. Yeah. The burgers available as well. And sausages. Look, so many different choices. This is kind of cool. These are like bottle caps. Put the cap on. Put it on, and then shake, 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 and then the flavor will come out, I think. See, it's, people are buying this like crazy. 
lighter soy. This is only 19 baht. And this taller one, like this, this is 12 baht. Seavit. Yeah, these are the ones. 16 baht. So many, many flavors and choices. Wow. A lot of people will love to drink this. It's like a shot of uh, vitamin C in the morning. Thank you, Jackson Wang. <laughs> Thank you, 7-Eleven. Palladium World Shopping Mall. There's a bank over here. I'll try to find a money changer for you guys as well. There are a couple of shops selling clothes, at least a few massage centers. There's a McDonald's over here. It's about a 300 meter walk from the hotel. Ronald McDonald in Thailand. We've got breakfast menus. Oh, wow. McChicken porridge, McPork porridge. So you have to cross the road. I think there's a zebra crossing over here. Cross this way. And the chicken rice shop is just ahead. So this is definitely the place, guys. This one, 1960. Uh, at this soy, Pechaburi uh, 30. All waiting to get in. Honestly, to me, it's a bit like roja sauce. You know, the boar roja. But it's not that fruity. It has some sort of like fermented taste to it. It's very weird. But it's okay, it goes well with the rice and the chicken. Some more kinds of food over here. Local food, all right opposite the hotel. Lots and lots of food. So guys, if you didn't take breakfast at the Berkeley Hotel, it is absolutely fine. There's so much of food everywhere. Look at that, satay. Goreng goreng, man. All right. This place apparently offers very, very good rates if you want to exchange money. If you are in need of the Thai butt, wherever you're from, remember the chicken rice shop? I was from over there, okay? So if you need this, just cross the bridge, come over here, it's just less than 200 meters. Come over here, and then make sure you have your passport so that you can exchange your currency. So at the Palladium Mall, we still have Starbucks over here and KFC is over there. And of course, if you're going to be doing a lot of walking, well, one of the best things you can actually treat yourself to is a massage. Go pamper yourself, go get yourself a leg massage, body massage, it's entirely up to you. You will be spoiled for choice. But then again, prices differ depending on the kind of spa you're in. And uh, the cheapest I've seen so far is from 200 baht onwards. Massage time. Let's go. Street food, guys. This is most delicious. <laughs> I think I'll try to order this with some egg. Can order uh, this one? With this one and uh, rice, uh, how much? Fifty baht. Ah, uh, Thai cup. So I eat here. Yeah, thank you. Great for breakfast or any time of the day for that better. Even supper. And plus, you got lots of chili. So bon appetit, guys. Let's try this out. It's really, really good. What else could you possibly want? Mm. Hotel's breakfast is good and all, but don't go for breakfast every day, guys. Save some money. Go outside, be adventurous, explore. Lots of food everywhere. That was the best tasting one I've ever tried. Very, very, very nice. So come and look for this auntie. If you're coming from the hotel from here, on the way to the uh, Pratuna Market, there's no number, there's no name, nothing. Just go in here, look for this family-run business. Okay. 
smells really good in here. Mm, room temperature water. Tom? Tom, yes. Tom. Nice to meet you, Tom. Nice to meet you too. I'm Alex. Andrew, Alex. Where are you mm. from, Alex? Malaysia. Malaysia. Yeah. So the name of this shop is M at D Massage. Yeah. So come. This is uh, in Pratunam area. Very good. Very professional, very friendly. And plus, free Wi Fi. Come over here, relax. Sabai sabai. Enjoy yourself. You have to remember this. Nak nak or bao bao. What does it mean? Bao bao is soft, soft, soft. Soft, soft. Soft, soft. soft, soft. soft, soft. Softer, please. Need noise. Softer. Need noise means a bit, a little bit. Okay. I, I think the people like the harder. Harder. Nak nak. Yeah. So guys, remember these two words. It will save your life. Don't say the wrong thing. Especially if you're Malaysian. If someone is pressing a bit hard, then you say, Adu, tak nak, tak nak. They, they might mistaken that for nak nak. Then they press harder. Hati hati, guys. That was a solid quality massage. The strength of Tom was just just nice. It's really one of the best. So highly recommended. Price is super affordable. So go pamper yourself, yeah. This is Indra Square. Go across, and then you will reach Ratunam Market. Bangkok traffic. Woohoo! Once you're done with Pratunam Market, you come up from this way and then make your way over to Platinum Mall, this side. This is the popular bridge. The weather is more or less the same in KL. Maybe one degree warmer. And on the highest floor, we have a food court up here at Platinum Mall. Uh, you got to get yourself a cash card before you buy any kind of food, yeah? Look at that, how busy it is. Okay, here's a little insider secret. This is Krung Tong Plaza. Krung Tong Plaza features fashion for plus-sized girls and ladies. Come over here to Krung Tong Plaza instead of uh, the others because here, majority of them feature plus sizes. Hien Xion Thailand. So 
here we are guys, we are here finally at MBK Centre. Remember, if you're using a cab, make sure they use the meter. If you're using a tuk-tuk, make sure you bargain, alright? Looks like they got a food fair outside as well. Mango sticky rice, 100 baht. Juices, fruits. Wow, look at those fruits. So colourful, right? Look at the size of those pomegranates. 80 baht. I told myself when I come to Bangkok, I'm going to be trying one of this. Lots of food. Look at that, look at all the prices. And it's halal, halal food. So Muslim friendly, yeah? Again, this is outside MBK uh, Centre. So this is a long line of food, stalls and also clothing as well. MBK is known for its copies, yeah, and all that. What you don't know is there's something called Super Sports Factory Store. Part of the store where it's called the last chance to buy. Okay, so these are the last chance to buy shoes. Okay, so all these shoes are at good prices because it's the last of its kind. Well, for example, like this, there's two left. Original price, uh, 2,795 baht. Now it's 559 baht. See? That's what I'm talking about. This one is not the last chance to buy. This one, you actually have to see if you got your size or not. Original price, 3290 Now it's 990 Oh, this is nice. Hyperburst. Wow. 2988 Now it's 897 Not bad. 1520 but Size 12, guys. Or 11. This is the last chance to buy. Men's section. See? They go by sizes 12, 11, 10, 10 and a half. So many. Wonderful place to shop. Look, they even have miso soup. Complete with wasabi in the morning and ginger. This is your salad bar. Fruits, milk, cereal. You got rice, fried rice with vegetables. Papadum Chicken sausage This is what the chef was doing earlier 
You got your omelets all ready. Boiled eggs too. I think these are uh, items that has pork in it, yeah? Ham. Ooh, interesting. Okay guys, so this is the way towards Big C Central World Siam Discovery, Siam Centre. Uh, from the hotel, as you can see, this is the Berkeley Hotel. Come down, cross the road, this is Platinum Mall. And you got to get on the Skywalk or something. And all the signs are here. Get up here. St. Seb Canal. Yeah, it's quite cool. Small park here. And you walk, 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 walk towards this way. Racha Prasong, our walk. Do you see over there? That's Big C. Big C supermarket where you can get some snacks and all that to bring home. And over here, you got a upper market shopping mall, Central World. the end of the video thank you very much for watching well overall the hotel stay was uh, okay definitely needs a lot of uh, upkeeping people are great here uh, believe it or not I think around my area half of Indonesia is down here <laughs> so many Indonesians are here Indonesians Filipinos uh, Singaporeans Malaysians of course and we got people from China Taiwan all over they're just here that's why Bangkok is the most visited city in the entire world so this place is truly happening it's great for shopping remember try to book earlier to get a better rate okay from the hotel if not there are plenty of other choices out there four star hotels three star hotels budget hotels it's all over the place so do some research and enjoy yourselves in bangkok well until then that's the end of the video again terima kasih those of you who are new to the channel, once again, if you enjoyed it or if you found it helpful, please, please do give it a like and also subscribe to our channel if it's at all possible. Until we meet again, bye-bye everybody. See you back in Kuala Lumpur.